Let's perform fundamental and technical analysis of Pfizer. We will cover all these points for better stock picking. Pfizer closed at $44.34, with the increase of 0.84% in the last trading session. Let's look at today's trend indicators. The moving average is bearish. Technical indication is in downtrend and overall daily trend for the stock is in very declining trend. Looking at weekly analysis, the weekly stock trend is in very declining trend. Today's market fear in greed index is 72, which is indicating greedy emotion in the public sentiment. We usually look at this indicator to make our buy or sell decisions better. Pfizer gave negative 0.85% returns in the last week negative 13.45% in the last 30 days, and three months returns are negative 4.75%. Now let's have a look at simple moving average data. Moving average indicates that what could be the next footprint of the stock price in near future. Five-day average is 43 with a bullish indication. 10-day is 44 with a bearish indication. 20-day average is 45, which is a bearish signal. Let's look at fundamental analysis. We will mainly see the last two quarters of the company. In June 22, the revenue was $27,742 million. In the recent quarter, September 22, it declined to $22,638 million. Now let's see the profitability of Pfizer. In the quarter June 22, the profits were $9,905 million. And in the recent quarter, September 22, the profits declined to $8,609 million. Let's see debt numbers. Debt to equity number tells us how much the company is in debt. In the first quarter, it was 0.53. Then it decreased to 0.5. Then in third quarter, it again went down to 0.44. In the recent quarter, the debt score increased to 0.46. Generally, this ratio should not be over 2.0. This is today's buy or sell decision for the stock, which is purely based on the technical indicators. This is not a recommendation, but use this just as a guiding pointer for your stock picking.